Hey everybody, welcome to Swonderful, week six. You know the drill. I'm gonna show you some backstage stuff, some um, events outside. It's almost showtime here. I'm listening to, well, this is my pre-show ritual. Someone actually tweeted me this week, what's your pre-show ritual? And I was like, that was in vlog one. So you need to go back and watch your vlogs. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but we talked about a lot of like backstage rituals last week and some more this week. And this is mine. I, t I was saying in vlog one that I listened to the song that Georges Guterri, who was the Henri in the film, he sings a song called I Dreamt I Was Back in Paris. Anyway, I love it. I still listen to it before the show. I love it, and that's it. I'm not gonna tell you what happens. You know, backstage, events, blah, blah, blah. Join me, week six. See you at the end. Are you videoing right now? I mean, look at this. Look at who is in this, who are in this room. Thank you, thank you, Edward. This is just um, amazing. Uh, I, I don't know, but you're a dancer. <laughs> you just expect to dance for the rest of your life. You don't expect things like this. Luncheons with magnificent people and being honored in a magnificent restaurant. So, What's the most <laughs> thrilling thing about being up, up at this luncheon for Cheetah with Max? The most thrilling thing is learning about formal wear from Max. <laughs> ah, yes. You know, there should be a she's tutorial. She's crushing your head. <laughs> oh my God. How dare you? I don't know who Cheetah is. Mont I'm, here, I'm here for Max. <laughs> Montego, you know who Cheetah Rivera is. I'm also here for Max, but I do know who Cheetah is. Spoons. One, two, two three. three. Spoons. It's like Ursula's okay. wig. Can I eat your cotton candy? Did you enjoy watching Ben Marie playing a flute yes. on a microphone at her ex? It wasn't loud enough, I couldn't film it, but so that's what just it happened. Like this. Ben Marie was like in the microphone. It was something. Is this, a, is this a scene from the new Sex in the City? Or are these just like the hottest, <laughs> the hottest women in New York? Look who's talking right now. <laughs> Wait, look <laughs> who's talking. I'm just going to lunch with Cheetah. <laughs> just had a quick little lunch at the Four Seasons with Cheetah Rivera. Right. That's no biggie. Supporting characters meeting. Commence. Commence. Uh, Brandon Uranowitz, Madame Tenardier. Oh. Jill Pace, Nabulingi. <laughs> Wait, who is that? Book of Mormon. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Max von Essen, Griddlebone. <laughs> Who's Griddlebone? The character in Cats. <laughs> Jill, you don't know your cats well enough. You don't know Book of Mormon enough. See you at the next meeting. <laughs> Ooh. Love this. It's almost like being there. <laughs> and Todd Ellison. Audience members. Let's see what else overhead. There. Stage right to left. Stage left to right. Front of house. Have a good break, Jill. You like my shoes? Aw, you're in the wrong musical. <laughs> Looking good. Looking good. I'm Are you <laughs> Of course, I've actually never been here at Intermission. This is good. Hey, we just finished the Masquerade Ball. The game! <laughs> the game! Remember Sarah Strimmel from last week's vlog? I'm dressed. Hey, Brandon, I have a question for you from someone. Yeah. From B Way Girl 24601. <laughs> she wanted to know I was wondering where Brandon got his throat steamer thing he said he uses at Intermission. Where'd you get that? Amazon.com. Really? And like, what's it? It's is it called, like a special it's name? It's called. <clears throat> hold on, let me just unhook this really convenient oh neck. Oh Wait, god. look. Oh god, Before get out of here. Before I tell you what it's called. <laughs> look, mom, hands free. <laughs> I can do all my stretching. Anyway, so let me unhook the strap. It's called My Pure Mist. My Pure Mist. Thank you. Yeah. Hey guys, what's up? I'm home. I'm at my piano. 
told some people I might play sometime. Anyway, so I got this Gershwin book when I was literally like teeny, a kid. I begged my mom for it and we couldn't afford it. And then months later, she surprised me with it. And you can see it's like falling apart. I used to plow through it when I was a kid. I have all these tabs in it for my favorite songs. I've been obsessed with Gershwin since I, was, since I was a little kid. Recently, I've been going through this other Gershwin anthology, just finding some songs that I never knew about. And I came across this song called Do What You Do, which I've never heard of it. I don't know if you guys have. I've never heard a recording. I don't know how it goes. But I've been sight reading through it, and I think it's really pretty. So anyway, I'm just going to kind of like see what happens. My piano's out of tune. Don't judge me. I'm sorry. It's a little out of tune. But I don't want to wait. So I'm doing it now. I never knew love was so nice. I never kissed anyone twice. Now each time you look my way, you're gonna hear me say. I think it's a pretty song. I screwed up a lot of chords. Don't judge me, piano players out there. I'm a little rusty. I've been trying to tap dance lately. That's where my focus is. Anyway, i just checking in. I'm home. This is my home life. I sit at the piano. I hang out. I've been obsessed with Gershwin since I've been a teeny tot. And that's a new song I'd never heard, so I wanted to sing it and play it for you. Bye, guys. See you soon. I want to thank you for allowing us to make you part of our collection. Uh, what an honor. Sure. Okay, let's see who I have. <laughs> Yay! Leanne. <laughs> oh. 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 I went to Disneyland when I was seven. <laughs> <laughs> Someone uh, drew me there in a tutu, and that dream came true, and now I have this. So thank you very much. Yeah! Oh. Oh. <laughs> this whole process has been such a dream come true and I was actually not tired as much as I would be in the show last night and I got a chance to watch you guys from the wings and you're just breathtaking and to be a part of you guys part of this show 
is a true honor, and to get to dance with you and to be on these walls, how incredible is this? So, thank you. Yeah. yeah. Honey, uh, one day they're you know, just crawling, the next day, diapers, wall of Sardis, wall of Sardis, throwing caricature. Robbie Fairchild, we love you. We love you. Supporting characters meeting comments! <laughs> Brandon Uranowitz, Emma Goldman. Ooh. Ooh. Jill Pace, Alfred. Oh. oh. Alfred? Hey, uh, uh, my Fair Lady? No. Alfred, uh, Dance of the Vampire? Yes! Oh my god, because oh. you know what I'm doing? Max von Essen, Miss Honey. Yes! That was, that was yes! mine today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is the part where Robbie basically passes out after his number. Everybody. He's so exhausted after his number, he collapses, puts his legs up. Sometimes he spits. I might hunk a loogie in a bit. This is theater, you guys. It's crazy what people go through. Robbie's a real pro. He has an Outer Critic Circle Award. Oh shit, I gotta make, I gotta make an entrance. Love you guys. <laughs> you guys, I don't think you've ever met Pecos, our elevator. The queen of the palace. The queen of the palace. Queen of the palace. Yeah. She's here. I'm here. <laughs> yeah! yeah! <laughs> it's Pecas. Pecas. Hola, Pecas. Vamos a ex exanario, por favor. Con gusto, señor. Gracias. She's been teaching us Spanish. Mm -hmm. We know we are we pretty know much pretty much fluent, fluent at this now. Point. We can get yeah. to the stage, to yeah. the basement, and our dressing room. At our, and our dressing room floor. Can no. we say hello? No dressing room. No? Mi camarino? Eso es. Sí. Ah. Sí, señor. Mm -hmm. Ciao. 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 Gracias, Pegas. Ciao, papi. Ciao. Ciao. Eight, three, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and talk to Please. Eight, Wait. four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. Nice lines. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And watch your feet. Two, three, <laughs> four, four five, six, seven. <laughs> Don't talk back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Open the book and hear. Dirty Rotten Scoundrels, Sherry Renee Scott, giving me some French, France, life tonight before the almost final show of the week. It's Saturday night, and I'm saying goodbye. It is week, what week was this? Six, two more weeks of our vlog. Next week is Tony Weeks coming up, Tony Week, and I'll take you guys to Radio City, not for the event, but I'll take you to some rehearsals and stuff like that. Um, the drama desks are tomorrow night, and then more backstage stuff. Thank you again. Thank you for hanging out with me. Week six, two more left of Swanderful. Missing it already. I miss you guys already. See you next week. <laughs>